Okay, this is Ringwalk Media in association with Well Eyes Therapy and Still Hub Management. Apparently, I've got his best side now. <laughs> Sam, it's great to see you. T- two, twice in two weeks. I'm yeah. blessed, mate. I'm blessed. You just keep, you just said I don't do it. Yeah, you fucking are. I know. Um, I'm good, mate. Really good. Been a hectic week, but now we're enjoying it here for Dan Toward this week. Yeah, we've calmed down after last week's shenanigans and uh, back to proper boxing for a little while. Yeah. Um, Listen, Dan Toward is a great, great amateur career. He started his professional career really, really well. Looking forward to seeing him on Friday. Yeah, I, I genuinely think he's one of, he's arguably, if one of, definitely the best prospects in the country. Um, and he's going to prove it again on, on Friday. I'm expecting a massive performance from him this week. From what I'm hearing about him in the gym from Dave, um, he's, he's, he's gone, he was already class, he's gone up another level. So really looking forward to watch Dan fight on Saturday. On uh, Friday, sorry. Friday, yeah. Um, so obviously his first performance was, was you know, superb. Um, but he's been now with Dave, what, six, seven weeks? it would be really interesting to see the changes and the progression that he's made under Dave. Yeah, absolutely. Dave's a fantastic coach and he would be, he's, he's just, he's told me he's taken to it like a duck to water. So we're, I'm, I'm honestly, when I say this, I'm expecting a standout performance from him. I'm expecting him to steal the show on Saturday, Friday again. Jesus. What do you, what do you think the differences are going to be? You, obviously a standout performance. What do you think? I think just thinking more about his work, uh, slowing it down just a little bit, picking his shots a little bit better and you're going to see a complete performance on Friday. We see the, the opponent that they've put him in with this time is a winning winning opponent, knows how to win. They've all been winning records because Dan doesn't need those type of fighters that are just there to shell up and survive. Dan's a tremendous fighter, he's had a tremendous amateur back pedigree. Um, I want to see Dan go through the gears on, on Friday. I've told him, I, I, get, I want you to get him out of there on Friday. We've all said it, we, want, we, we, we expect him to get his opponent out of there on Friday. And what would you like to see as a, a, a new skill from that we haven't seen before because obviously we know he can get them out of there but it's not, it's not just uh, it's not just a new skill because I know what Dan, Dan what Dan does just more relaxed uh, thinking a bit more about your work and just breaking your opponent breaking your opponent uh, down yeah and Dave's really good with that sort of stuff isn't he really good Dave's one of the best coaches in the country and that's why I was excited when we, we got them together and uh, look Dave's really happy with him if Dave's happy with him I'm happy with him because Dave spends all the time with him in the gym but I'm hearing sparkling reports sparkling like that haircut mate that haircut is bang on this week I'm telling you I don't know about that this, it, it, it gets done every Friday so it's a bit, bit grey as you can see so no be sparkling by Friday of course, TV audience for him. It's good to see him out there. And, you know, I think the viewing figures are going up every single show for Wasserman. Yeah, for sure. I mean, look, there's two live fights on, on the on the main broadcast on Channel 5, and Dan's going to be one of them. So, um, you can't, yeah, we can't we can't ask for any more than that. He's getting very well looked after, and it's, uh, it's brilliant for Dan and his profile. Well, listen, let's touch a little bit on last week. Um, we all know what was going on, Edinburgh and Manchester. Some real good fun back into British boxing. Uh, and the fight sold out in like 10 minutes. I mean, it, it, there was a view there to perhaps have a bigger stadium, surely. Yeah, well, listen, there is. But we're happy with what it is. The, the atmosphere is going to be electric in Leeds on the 27th of April. So let's just look forward to that and let's be thankful it got made. Because I, I am. I am. I mean, was it an easy make, that one? No, it wasn't, but we got there in the end. All good things happen, take take a while, so it took a while, but now I'm so happy it's done. Yeah, well, this, it, listen, we're, we're all looking forward to this one. I mean, the hype's, hype's there. Yeah. Um, two totally different fighters that we spoke about last week as well, so I actually don't think we're going to know what happens. You know, everyone's comparing it to the last fight, but actually this, this fight is different totally fight. different, isn't it? Yeah, it's a different fight this time. I think you're going to see a completely different fight. I think you're going to see a better fight. Uh, a more aggressive fight um, but yeah look April 27th it's here it's not far away now it's eight weeks eight weeks on Saturday can't wait well, so we can't wait for Friday your, your, your lad is uh, is a really nice chap actually we were chatting in the hotel before he's just totally boxing 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 isn't he he is and he's uh, as I say Dan's personality has not come out yet as the fights start getting by and he gets more cameras in his face you'll see his personality come out he's a great lad but he's He's about business, and Dan's going to go a hell of a long way. I'm very, very excited about him. He was saying he's really enjoying sort of being over with Dave and moving away from home and just completely focusing on that career. Structure, like you train at this time, you're doing your your strength work at this time. Just strength. He's not having to worry about any outside into it. He's moved away from home, which is a big step for a young man. He's still a very young man, and I'm I'm proud of him. He's and you'll see. 
He's going to steal the show on Friday. Very confident. Well, it's a nice way to end a good interview, Mr. Jones. It's very kind of you to give us your time, as always. And uh, bang an air cut, mate. Thank you very much. Cheers, mate.